Prevention of Diseases The diseases of humans can be prevented up to some extent by adopting certain precautionary measures. Personal Hygiene The diseases are the part of our life but by adopting several habits we can reduce them. Hygiene is the science to maintain cleanliness and health. The important factors of personal hygiene are Exercise and Rest 1. Regular exercise increases the general physical and mental health. It is good for people of all age groups. 2. Morning walk and yoga exercises are good for adults and aged people. 3. Children should play outdoor games. 4. Running, swimming, jogging, skipping are other exercises to be followed. 5. Every living being needs rest to recharge them. 6. We get perfect rest during sleep. 7. A healthy man requires 6 to 8 hours of good sleep daily. Children need more sleep for their good health. Personal Cleanliness We need our body, clothes, house and surroundings to be cleaned thoroughly and regularly. In dirty conditions, many germs attack and chances of infection increases. These infections can cause diseases. Personal cleanliness is most essential for good health. To maintain a good health, these suggestions should be adopted in our daily routine. 1. Wash your hands frequently. Before taking meals, hands should be washed by soap. 2. After taking meals, wash your hands and brush the teeth to remove small food particles. 3. Regular bath must be taken to clean the skin and entire body with a good mild soap. 4. Change your undergarments daily and if possible other garments too. 5. Keep the nails short and clean. 6. Eyes should be washed by clean water twice or thrice daily. 7. Ears should be protected from dust. Do not use matte sticks to remove the wax. Soft medicated buds should be used to clean the ears. 8. While studying, always sit in the right posture. Keep a distance about 40 cm from the book to the eye. Healthy Habits Good habits keep a person healthy. Many good habits should be adopted. 1. Smoking and drinking of alcohol must be avoided. 2. Proper control over emotions such as anger. 3. Food should be taken at regular intervals. 4. There should be a reasonable gap between dinner and sleeping. 5. We should breathe from our nose. Cleanliness of Surroundings Public Hygiene Most of us keep our home clean and maintain the hygienic conditions. Some of us have uncleaned personal habits which make it difficult to maintain a healthy environment. You may be clean, eat balanced diet and have happy atmosphere at home but your neighbour may dump garbage in the open. The drinking water supply may not be clean. These unhygienic conditions may produce disease causing microorganisms and you may get infected and fall sick. Thus, unhygienic personal habits can create health problems for you and the entire community. These precautionary measures should be followed for the health of the whole community. 1. All public places such as school, office buildings, bathrooms, laboratories, cinema halls etc. should be kept clean. 2. The eating places such as hotels, restaurants, dhabas and their surroundings must be kept clean. All eatable items must be kept covered. 3. All public drains and garbage must be covered and some disinfectants should be used. 4. The water should be kept free from germs and microorganisms by using chlorine or bleaching powder. 5. Spray the disinfectants over the stagnated water so that the mosquitoes do not breed over there. 6. For sewage disposal, proper dumping methods should be followed. Waste materials should be dumped in pits, techniques of composting and sewage treatment plants should be installed. 7. Avoid defecating in the open. 8. Trees should be planted.